Well, we're just weeks away from those generous servings of Thanksgiving turkey, and some of the birds are already being prepared. Our Stephen Cohn reports on a prison kitchen in Hagerstown where inmates are learning the meat cutting trade. Oh, this has, this has helped me a lot uh, to become a, like a better person as, as well, you know, as build my work ethic up. Ernesto Herrera has more than a year left on his sentence, but he is already preparing for a productive career. Uh, this is a pretty good opportunity here. Hopefully that helped me out. Uh, we enter society when I get out of here. It is part of a vocational training program run by Maryland's Correctional Enterprises. Once the, they get out of the apprenticeship program, they can actually be uh, released from here and they actually go to work on the street as a uh, meat cutter. And the turkeys they prepare in this correctional facility kitchen are being delivered to a Maryland nonprofit to share with families in underserved neighborhoods. I know the guys just takes uh, pride in everything that they do, so um, it's something to give back. These men put in 4,000 hours of training each. More than 122 men have finished the program and can earn up to $30 an hour on the job. It's a good thing to be able to do this and be able to give back, so, you know, it's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome to be able to do something positive, being able to give back to my family and be able to show them, you know, the right from wrong. And these turkeys are headed to Baltimore for a big Thanksgiving celebration. Reporting from Hagerstown, Stephen Cohen, DC News Now.